kind of just kind of put that weekend to the side and just kind of yesterday we focused on Holy Cross and now we're focusing on Cal and just go from there. We kind of just want to let that get behind us. And I mean, we had to lose eventually, but I mean, we probably didn't want to do that, but it's okay. We got a lot of games left. That uh, Paul seemed a little bit more, maybe not intense, but like, I guess kind of more making you guys look like you guys are more focused. So maybe, uh, is that something you kind of did over like yesterday in the game? And you know, is that something that you guys need to kind of focus on? Just yeah, we just need to like grow from that. We can't just let let uh, let that get us down, and we just kind of gotta kind of grow from that, become a tougher team, and just take it one day at a time. Have you ever faced uh, Cole in the or anything? Like yeah, I have. I did. What's his stuff? Like? It's gross. It's gross. He's a fastball, two seam. He's a two seam, four seam, good changeup, and a really good curveball. He's a really good pitcher. How'd some of those meetings go, you and him? Um, I think I got a few hits on him, but he got me out a few times too. So we kind of went back and forth. But he's a really good pitcher. What, what makes his stuff so special? It looked great uh, the last couple times he's been in. Uh, just he's a big kid with a live arm, and just God just blessed him with a really good arm, and he's got really good stuff with it. Um, we just got to take that and just kind of run with it. Just know that we're a really good team. The pitchers threw pretty well, uh, hitters did well, and we kind of just kind of got to put it all together this weekend and have a good full squad win. What, you guys, uh, what is kind of the focus for this weekend? Obviously, you're not, it's, it's, it's another weekend, and they're here at the box. You're a little bit more comfortable here, but it, it, what's kind of the focus for you guys? You know, for we haven't really talked about it yet because yesterday we were focused on Holy Cross, but I mean we'll probably have a meeting today about it and we'll go from there. What does Zach uh, help you guys do from a leadership standpoint? We've seen him uh, transition to a different role on the field, but now off the field as well with this team. How does he kind of set the table? Hess or Watson? Sorry, Hess. Hess, Hess is the man. Uh, he's the funniest guy on the team, and when he has to be serious, he can be serious and. He's just, he's honestly the best leader I've ever been around. He's just, he gets everybody focused and whenever, and when it's like game time, it's it's game time. Especially for, I guess, for this year also, I mean, for him in that leadership role, even though he hasn't pitched, I guess, exceptionally well, I mean, he's, trying, he's still trying to figure it out. Is it, um, does that change his kind of demeanor, or is he still kind of the same guy? No, Hess is always going to be the hardest working guy here. Uh, he's, uh, uh, they're in off season, he's here, he's staying here, he doesn't go home. He's working his butt off, but he's still the same guy 24-7. Uh, he's just a super hard worker.